Welcome to this demo of the Redware Connector for Power BI. We support Sage, Zero, QuickBooks Online, and Dynamics 365. I'm just going to show you the Sage connection. So here's Sage. Now, Power BI is a super duper data visualization tool from Microsoft, which starts from free or £7.50 a user, depending on how you want to use it. And uh, it's not that difficult to use, but it's quite difficult to extract the data from Sage. So here is our connector. Um, it's very easy to configure. I'm going to show you in about three clicks how you can uh, push the data to Power BI. So here you are. You set up your Sage connection. Make sure you can test through to it. We support all versions of Sage. You go to your Power BI section and this was going to export these uh, six or seven files to the temp power bi folder uh, now um, we've all we give you a power bi template that's already configured to extract from those data files into power bi so literally you're going to open up our power bi template that we will supply you're going to press refresh and it will replace this demo data with by uploading all the spreadsheets uh, from that folder uh, and it takes a minute or so and then all literally all your sage data uh, is going to be stored in the power bi model on power bi desktop um, and you can then use our visualizations um, so, for example, here are all the customers um, with, a, with, a, with a map. Um, here are all the sales. Um, and if so, you could just click. So, here are all your invoices. You can just click and you'll be able to see just the invoices for A1 design or just the invoices for uh, these, um, these uh, companies there. Um, so you're able, therefore, to publish this data um, for people within the organization to see without having to access Sage. And you can just refresh that uh, sort of several times a day automatically um, and publish your data. Uh, similarly, for suppliers and purchases, for products, you can see each product. You can see a little a visualization and you can break them down here. This is showing you. Um, invoices uh, or in fact invoice line items for each of those products um, we also break down the nominal nominals for um, your accounting uh, staff so you can you can click on the POA and these, this was showing you all the journals against uh, those nominals um, and it's, it's super fast because Microsoft have, have squashed and compressed everything into this Special format. Now, once that's ready, um, once you've done that upload, you can then publish it to Power Publish it to Power BI. Um, this is where you're going to have to pay. Uh, it's included in some Office 365 um, subscriptions in your E3. Um, and, but basically, if you publish it, you're then able to share that to everybody else that's got a Power BI um, um, account. Uh, with Microsoft again you see it, it's not taking too long um, but there's uh, Microsoft have a free gateway that will publish this data up to the web um, eight times a day if that's what you want um, so I'm just going to log into my Power BI so anybody now who's uh, you've allowed to share this will be able to see those same those same um, visualizations but this time on the web uh, so you can share that data model, if you like, uh, very easily. So if you want it for free, uh, you can just use uh, Power BI Desktop. Uh, if you want to publish it, um, just use your Power BI um, uh, licenses. And we've got all that data is has come up into uh, this model. So we don't hide anything. You can go and create your own um graphics and dashboards and so on using this data and what we're supplying you is this program here that basically extracts from Sage in a useful format for you to be able to use Power BI. Uh, so it costs £65 a month. Uh, please head over to redware.com or give us a call and um, we can get you up and running.
in a few hours. Thank you.